Hello everyone and welcome to my dearest garden. My name is Quilinthia and I am super excited today for a few reasons. For one, it is because you clicked this video. Thank you so much. And for two, I am starting seeds in my unheated greenhouse for the first time. This growing season is my experimental season. I want to see how these seedlings do in here only using the heat from the sun. It is February on this day of this video and it actually feels really good in here. So I'm using a seed starter mix I picked up at the store and I'm going to use a watering can just to moisten the mix up a bit. After it is saturated enough, I'm going to put the seed starter mix in these six cell trays that I purchased from Epic Gardening. I like these trays because they are tougher compared to the regular plastic cells, which makes them a little bit easier to handle and to reuse. Okay, I'm going to get these filled up, then start seeding. And the seeds I'm using are cool seeds and vegetables. So I'm doing collards, cabbage, lettuce, peas, and spinach. And just listening, that is making me hungry. Spring, whenever you're ready, I'm ready. <laughs> The cells are filled with soil now. I am making holes just using a marker and also going to use that marker to fill out the plant labels. Two to four seeds are going into each hole. I'm grabbing more mix just to spread over the top and then I'll stick the labels in as I go just so I don't get mixed up. When I'm done, I will place the humidity dome over them just to help keep the soil warm. Once I see germination, I will remove the dome. Water these in, and here is that dome I mentioned earlier. Now it has been 10 days, and I've sown a bunch more things in here, as you can see, mainly flowers, so we'll see how that goes. But so far, the collards have begun to come up. Makes me super happy to see them. I actually started three separate six cells of the collards, but only this one came up. So I'm leaving the other ones under the dome, but I'm taking this one out and I'm just gonna sit right here. My hope is to be able to give the extra collard greens I started to my Nana and Grandma. I just love their collard greens with cornbread. Oh my gosh, it's so good. If you live in the South, I'm sure you know what I mean. But last night it got down to under 30 degrees. So I covered this table with a frost cover just to be safe. And then when morning comes, when the temps rise, I'll just remove it. I am proud of myself for taking the leap to just try seed starting in here. I have been nervous about it since it is still winter and this greenhouse only utilizes the sun for heat during the day, but there's no heat at all at night. Like I don't have a heater in here. And for now, I don't really plan to get one. So really, if nothing else comes up, I will wait and I'll re everything in March when the night temps aren't as cold as they are now. I am in zone eight and we have a pretty long growing season here, so I still have time to start these again. But I have seen other people have success in unheated greenhouses, so my hopes are really high. I will do a 20 day, a 20 to 30 day update. So make sure to subscribe so you don't miss it and let me know below what seeds you are starting or plan to start. Again, thank you so much for watching and happy gardening.